Hello friends, welcome back again. So we are continuing the yesterday's class. So today it was a rainy day. So we are still now continuing the past history of the Indus Valley civilization from 2400 BC to the 700 AD, what we say. So children, I want to say one thing that starting from the roots, who laid the foundation of the Indus Valley civilization and what led the Indus people to come around and settle down on the Indus base. So then, next thing, the Dravidian aspect on the other side. We, have, we are here comparing both the issues side by side. So, Dravidian as per Dravidian theory, they say that we are the ancestors, they are the first migrants, they are the first residents of India. Is it possible? If they are, if they are the constructors of Harappa and Mohenjo-daro, local Dholi sites, then what are the reasons that made them to migrate from North India to South India? So, if we take the mythological aspects, the books that we refer, or what the hear, the stories we hear from our readers. So it doesn't matter. So recently, you can see the world Mohanjadaro is called becoming quite popular as a movie in Hindi is going to become. So now, what I want to say is these sites, the Harappa and Mohanjadaro sites. So that was gone in the Pakistan during the partition time. So. Hardly, as per archaeological excavations, we got one or two or three kinds which were shaped by the accredited holding person who was not having uh, multiple arms a single. We can say him as a, a homo serpent or a monolite or a person who was first civilized. He's a common group maybe. Not only me, it matches with the gravity so he may be worshipped as Shiva or Linda or what so then here the Aryan theory represented by Andrew this is that they are the successors of Iran so their language is proto-Iranian language Iranians got converted into Aryans. Iranians are not no one but Persians, the people of Persia who migrated. So here there's a big doubt, the gap that we had to fill out. So Aryans ancestors of Iranians, then who are the ancestors of Iranians? Maybe Mesopotamians, Assyrians. And who are they? Indirectly we have to take out the name of Egypt, the Nile, the Nile civilization. The World Historical Department also says that the Nile civilization existed, flourished firstly. So, by this all, a small litigation, so small confusion in the history is that either we have to accept the Nile civilization is the first or before the Nile, these people, Dravidians, as per the, let's say, they came and settled down here. Or the second thing, these are the important points you know, have to note down. Are they migrated to the ships have settled down mm -hmm. on the basins near the terminal or the Kshinata? Afterward, in our next classes, we can think about the mythological stories, the characters, the multiple has headed persons in the Ravana kingdom or whatever. But then we have to relate the Egyptian civilization with our Indus Valley civilization. Is there are any connections that we have to take out first? Then we can come to a conclusion. Who are the first and who are the superior? And from this only we can take out which text are the authentic for us. 
as Indians, it's our responsibility to protect the culture, the art, tradition, whatever. So, it's, let us know about this deeper in our next classes. Let me try this. I'm uploading these videos. Just as a trial, in future I try to develop the quality picture image as, okay, up to that. Bye.